along with Ray Ferraro, my name is Jane Stavalski. Welcome to St. Louis, Missouri. This has been played out in driveways, dead ends, back alleys, game seven. This is it. I was wondering where else you played. This is it. This is the most important game these guys likely will ever play. Opening face-off is just seconds away. Every game critical in the postseason. This one no different, and we are underway. Unloads it, and the stick his best friend on that save right there. Zero fear on this guy's part as he blocks it. Stays with it. A spirited battle along the boards for the puck. The Jets gain possession along the wall. Here they come. They've got numbers. Can't maintain possession. O'Reilly's lugging the puck. Passes over to Schwartz. Through the middle of the ice, they enter the attacking zone. From against the wall, it's centered out. Hangs onto the puck. Quick pass to Shifley. And he loses both the puck and his balance after that hit. The Blues carry it along the wall. From the slot, wrist shot, too much traffic in the lane. The Jets scoop it up along the boards. Here they come up along the wing. Taken by Hoffman. Hugs the boards through the neutral zone. He got all of that one. Battle along the boards. And pokes the puck loose inside the offensive end. Winnipeg's got a hold of it against the wall. Slides it diagonally to Pareko. Breaks up the pass in the defensive zone. Here he is, wrists it on net. Stick save by Bennington. Denies him again. Oh, he's locked right in. A couple of stops in a row there. Still early on in this frame, James and Ray with you. So glad you could join us. Still no score in this one. Stastny's won the face-off deep inside the offensive zone. Quick feed to Roslovic. Takes that pass back at the point. Sends the pass over. The Blues have it now. Feeds it to Fulk. Solid body contact. Looks to get the puck over to Bozak. From the right wing, he moves it to the middle. The Jets get a hold of the puck in their own end. Winnipeg's got it in the neutral zone. Puck grabbed by Falk. The Blues will play it in their own end. Gets the puck over to Falk. Quick pass to Sundqvist. And the puck leaves the zone. Here's a shot. Nothing. You kick yourself in the tail after you miss a chance like this. Has to be on the net. And he slides it quickly to Clifford. Sends a pass over, and he comes up with it. Inching closer to the midway mark of this period, we're still scoreless. Play resumes as they win the draw here inside the offensive zone. The Blues have it against the wall. Officials blowing the play dead. We've got a penalty on the way here. The Jets have been called for hooking. Even though he's going to argue this, I mean, there's nothing to argue about. His stick gets across the player's midsection. It's a penalty. And the man advantage unit comes out to go to work. This has been a pretty tightly played game, but now they've earned the game's first power play. So they've got an opportunity to get the first strike on the board. Start with an offensive zone face-off and a chance to get out in front. From his own end, he moves it up ahead. The Jets will kill off a few extra seconds now. Gets it out of his own end. And now it's over to Tarasenko. Can't catch up to the pass. Kind of lost control for a second there, but regains possession. Along the boards, they battle for the puck. And now he angles it across to Morrissey. Can't connect. Stick save and a butte by Bennington. And he came out and challenged him. Good save. Great timing to come up with the interception. Fantastic save. St. Louis moves it ahead. 
Ahead of steam now towards the front. Moves it around along the half wall. Denies him in front. Scooped up along the wall by Fortwork. And they'll get it out of the defensive end. The Blues gain control of the puck against the wall. And now they look to make something happen from the neutral zone. And it takes a shot and makes the save. Moves it on over to Pionk. The Blues fail to capitalize on the power play. Both sides back to even strength. We are still tied. The only positive for the power play there is they didn't have to skate up and down the ice. They didn't generate anything. They had it in the zone, but really, nothing very good about it. Moves it to Hoffman. Driving right to the front. He grabs the puck here at the point. Coming down the left wing and into the zone. Move to the middle and puts it anywhere but the way he wanted it to go. Hit the net. No chance to score if you don't get the puck on target. St. Louis takes possession along the wall. Moves it quickly over to Sundqvist. Here he is in front. And a stick in the lane ends that threat. Pushes it across to line A. Takes a shot, and that goes off a player. Here's a short pass to Bolia, and that carries off a stick. Taken along the wall by Shifley. Lifts the stick and takes the puck. Puts it away to stay on the attack. And they can't connect. Quick shot, oh, it comes up with nothing on the play. Takes the pass. And the puck departs the zone. Smart defensive play here in the open ice. Quick pass to Sundqvist. And they fail to go take to take. Turn that one aside. Pullman's got it now deep inside his own end. Oh, a violent collision against the wall. No matter what you do, that's never going to feel good. Gives them nothing in front. Along the wing, up the neutral zone. And the puck skips away after that move. There are times you try to do too much. He's got good hands, but maybe a more simple play is the right one there. Oh, just wide! Oh, man, he scores on the one-timer! The good thing he one-times this puck. The goalie almost gets there, but the pass is on his tape in the low slot, and he beats him clean. The Blues have simply dictated how this game has gone so far. They have the majority of the shots, the majority of the zone time. And as a result, they've been able to capitalize on the chances that they've had. Winnipeg's got the puck along the wall. Exploring options here inside the defensive zone. And he denied that opportunity. Well past the midway mark of this period, the Blues have taken a 1-0 lead. Winnipeg's won the draw. Quick feed to Ehlers. Slides the puck over. Let's it go, and he makes the save. Picked up along the boards by Wheeler. Pokes it away in his own end. And that's picked off in front. Takes the feed. The Blues played along the boards. Winnipeg's got a hold of it along the wall. Passes on over to Ehlers. Gains the zone through the middle. The Jets ready to go on the attack. St. Louis gains a hold of it. O'Reilly's taking it from his own end. They try to maintain possession inside the defensive zone. Centered out in front. No, oh, denies him with the save. I think he got the blocker on it. Hoffman's picking up steam. Puck picked up by O'Reilly. Throws it in. The Jets get a hold of the puck along the boards. Picked up along the wall by Morrissey. With the puck inside the defensive zone. Dishes it to Pareko. Moves the puck. Denied by Hillebuck. Aggressive stop out on top of the crease to make the save on a dangerous chance. The Jets are on the attack. 
and tries to make a diagonal pass to Morrissey. And misses on the tip. No, he's got to get that on target. That's a scoring chance, and he doesn't even make a, the goaltender make a save. Knocks the puck loose. Here's a shot, and he says no. As a great older colleague of mine says, this is waffle boarded away. The centermen glide into position. St. Louis has it in their own end. Winnipeg's got the puck along the boards. Stopped with ease. Moves it over to Bozak. Nice poke check inside the attacking zone. Cuts to the front. An easy save by Bennington. I wanted another look at this one. I'm sure you guys were all impressed as I was. What a save by the goalie. Here in the late going of the frame, one nothing the score. Winnipeg's got it in the offensive zone. Moves it to Shifley. That pass goes a little sideways. Streaking through center, they go on the attack. Here's a shot denied by the goaltender. Through the neutral zone, moving the puck along the side. There's the whistle. Offside is the call. We go back to look at this on replay. Man, defensively, is that a mess. A three-on-one against, yet the goalie bails them out. Sunfist won it. And now it's grabbed by Scandella. Moves it quickly over to Clifford. And that one stopped. No, he, he scores! He thought he had it, but it must have gone off him. It's in the net, and that's a goal! Man, it looks like a bus depot in front of the net. You know it's a tough one when you can't see the goalie. That means he can't see the puck. The setters will glide into the dot. Setters jammed up and the winger grabs the puck. Big play inside the defensive zone. And he loses possession of the puck after trying to make one too many moves. There are times you try to do too much. He's got good hands, but maybe a more simple play is the right one there. St. Louis looks to break out in their own end. The Blues looking against the half wall. Winnipeg's gained possession along the boards. Up along the wing. Pokes the puck away. Can't hang on after that hit. Can't find his man. Nice pass. Dropped him in the open ice. And he somehow gets a piece of it with the glove to keep it out. Sometimes you're in close, there's no room to put it anywhere. The goalie smothered it all. Wow, did the ice get small for him. There's nowhere to go, and he had to absorb this huge hit. Here in the late goings of the period, the Blues now lead by two. St. Louis takes possession off the draw. Solid hit on the play, and that knocks the puck off his stick. Denied that one. Ehlers' first game now includes a shot on goal. He's been up with that injury, and I wondered if he would be slowed at all. Winnipeg's won the faceoff. Here's a short pass to Lewis. Receives the pass. Stick save from the goaltender. Somehow the shooter got loose in the slot, but the goaltender's equal to the task. That's a good save. The Jets have a hold of it in the defensive zone. Working the puck deep inside their own end. Trying to get back on the attack now. The Jets gain possession along the wall. Quick pass to Lowry. Dumps it in. Handles the puck. Quick feed to Hoffman. The Blues take it across the blue line. The Jets scoop it up along the boards. Grabbed along the boards by Pion. Dishes it to Lewis. Takes the feed. St. Louis gets the puck near the boards. 
The Jets have it in the offensive zone. And he blocks the shot. Great defensive play. Gets in front of it. Well, you're not going to get much better scoring chance than that one. But the goaltender makes an excellent stick save. Puck possession so critical. Another faceoff coming up here. St. Louis wins the draw. And now he moves it to Perron. Sends the pass over. Oh, smart heads up play to poke that one away. There's the horn, completing the first 20 minutes. See a few fans already jumping the gun there, trying to beat some of the lineups in the concessions and the washrooms. It's 2-0 after the opening frame. Pretty good start for one side, not so much for the other. If you want to show us your accuracy, register now for our Shoot to Win contest, where one lucky fan will shoot a puck from center ice to try and win. As both teams get a breather, so will we. We'll take a quick pause for the cause. here on period number two. O'Reilly's one possession. Moves it to Tarasenko. Moves it up through the middle from the right. Puck scooped up by Tarasenko. Big save by the goaltender. Can't keep a hold of it. And that one's broken up by a great defensive play. Pionk's got the puck. Maintains possession. And that one's broken up by a great defensive play. And we've got a two-on-one. And that one's broken up. Directed over to Morrissey. Looks to pass it to Connor. Moves it quickly over to Shifley. Takes a hit. He goes down to the ice and coughs up the puck. Strong defensive effort. And he slides it quickly to Schwartz. St. Louis plays it along the wing. And they come up empty-handed. Ehlers brings it in. Lewis has possession of it now. Deflected away. Nice defensive use of the stick there. Comes up with the stop. Bennington's goaltending at one end and the offensive output at the other has made for a good night. I love these second looks at this. You see the player transfer his weight, hammer the slapper, but the goalie makes the save. James Sabalski, Ray Ferraro with you here in the early going of this period. St. Louis leads it 2-0. Move to the middle. Battle along the boards. Pokes it away here in the neutral zone. Taken by Perron. The Jets have it against the wall. From the defensive zone, they move the puck around. Went for the dirty dangle, and it goes sideways. He's got good hands, but I think he overdoes it a bit here. Now he doesn't have the puck anymore. Sends a pass over. And that one's picked off. Oh, had a chance to make a nice move, and the puck disagreed with him. Scrum along the boards. Scooped up along the wall by Perron. St. Louis plays it along the boards. Makes a move, and the puck hops away from him. And couldn't find the intended receiver on that one. The Jets gain control of the puck against the wall. Can't connect! Puck grabbed by Bozak. He takes a moment to backtrack, but maintains possession. From the point, looks to make something happen. Here's a short pass to Polia. The Jets move the puck in the defensive zone. Stastny swooping in on the attack. Tries to feed it over to Sanford. They go on the attack through center. Quick pass to Thomas. From Whoa. point blank, he scores! That's three, Ray! Yeah, just to have not taken their foot off the gas pedal at all here. Once they got that first one, they kept pushing away. Now they've got three. Goalie just can't keep up with this. He's close to the net, but he's still able to have enough room to beat the goaltender. St. Louis 
has my broadcast partner smiling between the benches. Ray, lots of goals. You know I love goals, James. Unfortunately for the game, they've all come from one team into the other net. Now, maybe these other guys can wake up here in the last half of the game. In this third period, will be filling the net at both ends. Quick feed to Morrissey. And that's broken up with a stick in front. And that pass goes awry. Knocked off the puck. Winnipeg's playing it from the side. Tries it to the crease. He gets a piece of it with a stick. Yeah, he got out tight to him, James. There's nowhere for that puck to go. From the left side, they enter the offensive zone. Puts it up front. Big time save by Hillebuck. The shooter's right in the guts of the ice, but the goalie squares up, spreads out, and makes the save. No quarter given here as they battle for the loose puck along the boards. Skates across the blue line. Sends one up to O'Reilly. And now he tries to get it across to Tarasenko. And it's a quick pass to O'Reilly. Winnipeg's got a hold of it against the wall. Taken along the wall by Morrissey. Moves it to Pionk. Directs it on over to Morrissey. Good hit to pump him off the puck. Knocked away. Picked up along the boards by O'Reilly. Puck picked up by Connor. Here he is, shot right in front, and that clangs off the iron. The Jets don't need a shot off the goalpost. I think what they need here, James, is a field goal to get back in this contest. Nice stick work to knock the puck loose. Winnipeg's on the attack. And now it's over to Forborg. Too much congestion in front. And now it's grabbed by O'Reilly. And he gains the zone here. Moves it quickly over to Sanford. Off a stick. Puck scooped up by Pareko. Here's a short pass to Tarasenko. Takes the pass. Winnipeg's looking to break out. With possession along the wall. Stasty's caught with the stick and the officials are signaling for a hooking penalty. And the play is whistled dead and here's the call. This is a good old fashioned hooking the call here. He looked like he was water skiing. Man, you gotta move your feet, you get your stick around his waist, you'll get called. Well, this gives us our first chance to take a look at the team's power play unit. It'll be their initial power play of the evening, James. The best power plays, they move the puck and move their feet at the same time. You'll force the penalty killers back a little more defensively than they'd like to be. And a strong effort on that play. Getting closer to the halfway point of this frame, the Blues are in cruise control, leading it 3-0. And with the two tied up off the face-off, a great read to grab possession of the puck. Taken by Connor. Here's a chance, and that goes wide. He's got to do something a little better than that. Just can't finish it from there. Wonder if that gives him a nightmare later. Slides it across. What a steal in his own end. And the puck is cleared to a safer spot. Ehlers plays it now. Offside is the call, and we'll have a face-off just outside the offensive zone. James and Ray with you tonight. More than half the period has been played. St. Louis has dominated to this point. They lead it 3-0. The Blues win the face-off. Cross-corner dump in. Winnipeg's got the puck along the wall. Feeds it on over to Wheeler. Takes the feed. Cutting to the front of the net. Good defensive effort to poke it away. Here he is from the slot. Oh, and it goes just wide. Just wide, way wide. It doesn't matter. It's not on the net. He's got to get that at the goalie. Oh, making his presence felt with a hit. Great reflexes. Another save. Quick reflexes. You make one, you make two stops before the puck is cleared away. Tremendous read as he pokes it away with the paddle. The Blues get their man back out of the box. Really aggressive work by the penalty killers. They shut that power play down without any danger. Jabs the puck away. Solid hit on that play. Through center along the wing. And they'll be forced to regroup after the puck bounces out of the offensive zone. 
forces the turnover. St. Louis, he might have a step here. No one back, a 2 on 0 Great save. Oh, I thought he was going to beat him, but the goalie comes up for St. Louis is taking the will away from their opponents each time they finish another body contact. You can see them shrink, and now they've stretched out their lead. The Jets have had a lot of good looks offensively, but they still trail in the second. The Blues win the faceoff. Here he is in close. Stones him in front. Here they are on the attack. St. Louis gains a hold of the puck against the boards. Nice pass. With some open space at center. Picked up along the wall by Shen. A shot, and the traffic neutralizes that threat. From the left wing, takes the feed. The Jets play it along the wing. He almost lost it for a second there, but regains control of the puck. Answer the call on that play. No room for the shooter. The goaltender snuffed it out. Stopped by the goaltender. I think through traffic like that, you're just hoping the thing hits you. Pokes the puck away. And now it's grabbed by Falk. Slides it over to Steen. Quick pass to Clifford. Winnipeg's got a hold of it along the wall. Through center. Puts it in deep. The Blues have it from their own end. Slides the puck over. Clifford's got it through center. And we'll get a face-off while one lucky fan gets a souvenir. Bennington's been perfect so far. He's kind of doing this all by himself. So busy, and he's been phenomenal tonight. More than half the period has gone by. Hope you're enjoying this one. The Blues have dominated this one to this point. They lead it 3-0. Nice job tying up his opponent. Angles it over to Connor. Great defensive play to come up with the puck. And loses possession after a solid hit. Pinned up along the boards. And a nice poke check inside the neutral zone. Oh, a little too much stick work. And the officials with their arms in the air. And the officials signaling for hooking on the play. Got to move your feet here. You're chasing the play. As soon as you stop your feet, you're going to get called. And the man advantage unit goes right back to work. Well, the power play gets another opportunity. They haven't been super busy tonight, but here's a chance to get on the board. Trying to clear from the defensive zone. Whistle blown as a few players go ducking for cover on the bench. Just here in the late stages of this frame, three nothing is where we sit. Shen's won the draw. Shoots it, comes up with the stop. I think he got a blocker on that one. Takes a couple of knocks and loses control. Along the boards, they battle for the puck back and forth. Big save. Sharp reaction save. Ah, oh, there's going to be a penalty on this play here, James. There's the whistle. Penalty coming up. And he's going to get two for hooking on the play, Ray. He should. I mean, he gets his stick out parallel to the ice. He gets it across the player's midsection. And that's kind of a red flag for that penalty. St. Louis has lots of time for this five on three. Pretty lengthy five on three here. And you'd like to attack and get one early so you have a chance for multiple goals. They move the puck out of harm's way. St. Louis takes possession along the wall. Moves the puck. Quick feed to Shen. Chase right in front. Misses the net. Just misses the net, but really the scoring chance is not dangerous if you can't get the puck at the goaltender. Play set to resume with the faceoff ready to go. The Jets win it in the defensive zone. Hellebuck's going to cover it up and get a whistle. Even with the traffic starting to close in, he had to grab that when he did. Well, that's one way to win the draw as he skates away with the puck after the two centers were tied up. And they can't convert to the play! Moves inside! And that's blocked! Trying to get the puck out of his own end. And a nice job by the Killers on that one. Yeah, now they can get a change, get some fresh players on the ice. The Blues move to the offensive zone. 
Grabbed along the boards by Tarasenko. Snaps one from the slot, turns it away. Oh, you're not going to get a better chance than that, but the goalkeeper does a great job. And they move the puck out of harm's way. The Blues gain possession along the wall. Across the line from center. Moves it to Thomas. Here he is in front. Oh, he got all of that. What a save by Hellebuck. And they manage to clear it. Time running out with this man advantage. Here we go. It doesn't really matter that the power play didn't score. They've got such a nice lead. But I'll tell you, as a guy that made a living on the power play, I wanted to score every time I was out there. Puck grabbed by Roslevic. Denied by the goaltender. Hellebuck's right on top of this scoring chance. Nowhere for the puck to go. Wheeler's got to be the lead dog here. I, there are times when a captain can be just one of the leadership group, but when you're down by this much, you've got to show the guys that the game can't end. You have to play hard still. Oh, a clutch save! Bennington Sharp to make that stop. A little crashing and banging forces the turnover. And the puck escapes the zone, and they'll be forced to tag up. Bennington's been perfect so far. He's kind of doing this all by himself. So busy, and he's been phenomenal tonight. Late goings of this period, it has been a one-sided affair. 3-0 is where we sit. Stastny's won the draw here in the open ice. The Blues have the puck now. They've got numbers. It's a two-on-one. Pokes it away to keep the pressure on. Moves it quickly over to Bortuzzo. Receives the pass. Can't finish. Oh, Ray, blown opportunity. It really is. I mean, the play is sitting right there. There's a scoring chance to be had. They just don't execute it. Here's a short pass to Bozak. Shot right in front. Stopped by the goaltender. Slides the puck across to Thomas. Taken by Bortuzzo. Quick pass to Bozak. Right in front of the net. Paddled away by Hillebuck. Handles the puck. Up along the wall on the right side and into the attacking area. Off his stick and puts it. Oh, look at that. Here we go. We got a penalty coming up right here. And the horn sounds to stop the bleeding, at least for a few minutes anyway. Are you ready for a walk down memory lane? Then it's time to sign up for our fantasy game. Play hockey with childhood heroes. It's a fun-filled week full of memories. All is for details. Don't go anywhere. The third period is just moments away. Opportunity to score a quick one here in the period as they start with the man advantage. Can't keep a hold of it. Winnipeg's got possession while undermanned. The Blues scoop it up along the boards. Quick pass across to Tarasenko. Right up the gut into the attacking zone. He scores! All oh, one up. Finish and sends the water bottle flying. A goal is a goal, but when the bottle pops, you go back to the bench feeling pretty good about yourself. He's popping bottles tonight! Man, the goalie's gonna look at his teammates and say, is anybody gonna cover the high slot? He was so open, he was able to hammer home the one-timer. Winnipeg's going to make a change in goal. He can't get over to the bench quick enough. Now he can get rid of that mask, throw in a ball hat, wrap a towel around his neck, and try and relax. This has been a rotten night for him. St. Louis has seemingly found a way to get almost everybody on the scoreboard here tonight, Ray. Yeah, now it's at the point, James, that guys are starting to be point-hungry, and 
You want to pad your own stats, you get up in a game like this, you'll take a chance that you wouldn't in a 2-1 game. Does that happen much? Oh, yeah. When we were ahead, I was always digging for another goal somewhere. <laughs> Good heads-up play in the defensive zone. Quick feed to Pareko. The Blues take it along the wall. Puck knocked loose in the neutral zone. St. Louis has it in the defensive end. Knocks the puck away in the open ice. Winnipeg's gained possession along the boards. Puck picked up by Pareko. St. Louis plays it up ahead. Puck dumped in. The Jets have it against the wall. Looking for space inside the D zone. Here's a chance to his teammate. Oh, what a great stop as he got a piece of it with the glove. Good battle along the boards for the puck. St. Louis has possession of it now. Gaining momentum along the wing. Scooped up along the wall by Perron. Puck scooped up by Connor. Now a quick pass to Wheeler. Great stick work with the steal. Perron's got it along the wing. Moves it to Dunn. Denies him in close. Here's a chance. Oh, and another big stop. Oh, he's on it there. Both saves are really good ones. Here's an odd man rush. Right in front. Stopped by the goaltender. Pennington's read the situation, and he's just going to let it breathe here, Ray. Well, every once in a while, the goalie will get a sense that the guys are starting to run around. He's been on top of it tonight. Been an excellent game. Lots of hockey left to be played in this period. St. Louis came to play. They lead it 4 nothing. And now he moves it quickly to Perot. And that sails over the net. I'm going to have to get both hands out to count the number of misses he's had tonight. What a long evening. Moves it quickly over to Dunn. And he slides it quickly to Sanford. Winnipeg's got a hold of the puck. Along the right wing, they enter the attacking area. St. Louis gets the puck near the boards. Smart defensive play there. St. Louis plays it against the boards. And he slides it quickly to Steen. Takes the feed. Puck sent over to Lowry. Couldn't find the intended target. The Jets pick up the puck here in the neutral zone. To the front! Denied by Bennington! Tarasenko's played so well in this point streak, you know he wants to pile on it. Inching closer to the midway mark of this period, St. Louis just absolutely putting the boots to them, leading 4-0. While the setters are jammed up, nice job by the winner to steal the puck. Chance in front, comes up on the blocker save. Oh, he had to get up tight to the puck, in close. He takes away any room. Winnipeg's looking to break out of their own end. Sends the pass over. Along the half wall with the puck. Here's a short pass to Lewis. Slides it back to the blue line. Centering pass! Great poke check on the reach. Stays with it. Scrum along the boards as they battle for the puck. Pokes it away to stay on the attack. And now he angles it across to O'Reilly. Smart defensive play here in the open ice. Along the right side into the offensive zone. Can't keep a hold of it as he's jostled off the puck. Taken along the wall by Bortuzzo. And he regains control of the puck. Quick pass to O'Reilly. Moves the puck along the half wall. Takes it into the slot. Stopped by the goaltender. Yeah, he makes a nice save here with the glove, as you mentioned. But he's able to hang on to it. That's a tough save from this position on the ice. Sends a pass over. Sends it across. Scores! What a shot! Excellent puck movement on the odd man rush. They catch them short and they make them pay. back to center ice. Is this their best performance we've seen this year? Offensively, it's as good as any other night that they've had. Domination in the offensive zone. 
Quick feed to Tarasenko. And it's a quick pass to Cruz. And tries to make a diagonal pass to Schwartz. Huge steal in his own end. The Jets carry it along the wall. Moves it to Wheeler. Stopped by the goaltender. Again, the denial by the goaltender. Smothered that in close chance. And now it's to O'Reilly. Puck knocked loose after that hit. The Jets will play it in their own end. Picked up along the boards by Morrissey. The Jets take it along the wing. They've got the defense outnumbered. Great stop by Bennington. And pokes the puck loose inside the offensive end. Penalty coming up as the whistle stops the play. Wheeler's going to the box for tripping. Always a little careless to get a tripping penalty. You get your stick into the player's feet, and when he goes down, you're going to go to the box. Another scoring opportunity looms here. As someone who played a lot on the power play, you get one early in a game, it gives you more confidence. They look like they're ready to get another one. Takes a shot, and that goes off the player in front. No quarter given here as they battle for the loose puck along the boards. Let's it go! Denies him in front. Still lots of time left in the period. The Blues all over them tonight. They lead it 5-0. Nice start winning the draw here inside the offensive zone. And too much traffic in front blocks that one. Moves it quickly over to Hoffman. Looking to make something happen in the offensive zone. And that one's broken up by a great defensive play. Now a quick pass to Tarasenko. Passes the puck over to Fulk. Right to the crease. Blocked in front. The Jets gain possession of the defensive zone. Working the puck deep inside their own end. And now he moves it to Polia. Feeds the puck over to Lewis. And he's tripped up on the play. Referee's hand goes up here. Time for the official to pass down his sentence. Now you react. You go to get the puck and you stick your stick into the guy's feet. Down you go. Two minutes off to the box. And on the heels of that call, we get ourselves a little four-on-four -on, -four on the ice. Really only two ways to play the four-on-four. -four. You're either uber-aggressive or you're ultra-conservative. I want to be aggressive, force the other guys into a mistake. His reflexes on display tonight. Past the midway mark of the frame, James and Ray with you tonight. The Blues came to play, and boy, did they ever, leading 5-0. Winnipeg's won the draw, and they'll go to work. Came up with the save on that play. And as he stumbles, he coughs up the puck. The Blues play it along the boards. Here's a chance, a two-on-one. And as the penalty expires, they'll go to work now with a man advantage. Pumps the puck away. Sends it in on the attack. Winnipeg's got the puck behind the net. Referee singling the late penalty. Looks like hooking will be the call. And he sprints to the bench to get the extra attacker out on the ice. Here comes the call. The Blues have been handed two minutes for hooking. Like every player in the history of the game, he doesn't like the call, but he's going to have to go <laughs> serve his minor penalty. Two-man advantage coming up here. Drives me crazy, James, on a five-on-three power play, how slowly some of the teams move the puck. The penalty killers can't keep up if you move it quickly. Here's a short pass to Rostovic. Another stop by the goaltender. Stop one, stop two. The goalie makes a couple of excellent saves. The Jets gain control of the puck against the wall. Takes the pass. Almost lost the puck, but hangs on here as play continues. From the blue line, they take control of it. The Blues get a hold of the puck under man. Winnipeg's got control of it now from their own end. Feeds the puck to Connor. Takes the pass from the left wing. A little dipsy doodle and he loses possession of the puck. They clear the zone. More time off the clock as they grab the puck. 
Nice zone entry from the right side. Picked up along the wall by Sundquist. And now he moves it quickly to Pareko. Move to the middle. One last rush here on this power play. Quick pass to Stastny. The Jets take it along the wall. Couldn't make that one happen. Puck clears the zone. Grabbed along the board by Bozak. Thomas is out of the box. Both sides back to even strength. Well, a good power play is about 20%, James. That one falls in the other 80%. They don't get it done. The power play expires. St. Louis has the puck. Slides the pass over to Steen. He's got a step. With the stop. Save made by the goalie. Nice work in there after the first stop. He's got to find the puck to save the second. If you're going to make the save as the goalie does here, you've got to read the play and have the reflexes to execute the save. Past the midway mark in this period, we are in blowout territory right now. It's 5-0. St. Louis takes possession off the draw. And he stands tall in goal! Officials getting ready to drop the puck. Puck possession so key in today's game. The Jets win the draw. Winnipeg's got the puck in the defensive end. The Jets gain possession along the wall. Takes the feed. Pass across to Ehlers. Strong defensive effort. Hammers one. And that shot goes nowhere as the lane was filled. Can't hang on to the puck after the play. And now it's grabbed by Fogler. The Jets will play it from the defensive zone. That's a solid hit. The Blues get a hold of the puck along the boards. Look out, a two-on-one. And that one's turned away. Let's get another look at that hit. This becomes a dead end in a hurry. Watch how he lays the shoulder. Right there. That's a big hit. Here in the late goings of the period, one-sided, lopsided, blowout, you name it, 5-0 is where we're sitting. Play resumes here as he wins the draw inside the offensive zone. Centered out in front, big save. Bully is gaining momentum. Nice pass. The Blues take possession in the defensive end. St. Louis gains a hold of the puck against the boards. Here they come up along the wing. Hangs onto the puck. St. Louis plays it against the boards. Winnipeg's got the puck in their own end. There's a shot, and there's the save. Brassois has done nice work here on this scoring chance to turn it aside. The Blues win it, and he slides it quickly to Scandella. Knocked around, but keeps it going. Here's a shot. Blocker save, and he's showing up big time tonight. Right up front. There's another stop. He's sharp on this one. Out on top of the crease aggressively to make the save. And that's out of reach and out of the offensive zone. Feeds the puck to Hoffman. It's a two-on-one. Here's a chance. How did he stop? Nice move by the goalie to get out close to the shooter. Feeds it down low. Saucer feed. Loose puck battle along the boards. Moves up near the blue line and looks to set up at the point. Big save by the goaltender once again. Why a goalie can never relax. He makes one stop. Now he's got to be sharp to make another. Couldn't connect on that pass. Slides it to Stastny. From the left side into the middle of the neutral zone. St. Louis moves ahead with the puck. Less than 60 seconds to play in this blowout. Strong defensive effort. Loses possession after he takes a little hit. St. Louis gains a hold of it. Slides the puck over. Through the open ice, they're picking up steam. And now he tries to get it across to Bozak. Oh, he'll feel that one. Moves into the slot. Comes up with a monster save in front. High quality chance, high quality save. Quick feed to Shifley. And we've got a two on one. He was locked in there. 
Pennington's got the puck, and he elects to hang on for a stoppage of play. Now we're in the third period, James. It's pretty safe to say he's been on top of his game tonight. Not much has given him a problem. St. Louis up big time late in this third period. They have been the better team tonight. And a solid job tying up his opponent. Scooped up along the wall by Crew. Drives to the paint! Made the stop on the play. I like how he was able to follow the puck. Good save in close. With the forward driving towards the net, the defenseman trying to keep him away. These collisions happen. The net's not going to stay on the moorings very long. St. Louis is trying to maintain this lead late in the third period. The Blues take possession off the faceoff. And now it's over to Schwartz. Great goaltending, solid defending, and great offensive efforts. And it all adds up to move it on. Nice quick check inside the attacking zone. And makes the save. Such an intense battle, and they're moving on winning this one. Way more satisfaction winning a series than anything in the regular season. Now you get to keep playing. A lot of smiles as they make their way through the ceremonial handshake, and rightly so, they were good this series. They were good this series. They've really deserved to be on the winning side of this. They were just able to execute a few more plays at critical times. On behalf of Ray Ferraro, I'm James Sabalski. Thanks for joining us. Good night.